These are your Harvard University Top 5 Plays of the Week, presented by GEICO. At number 5, women's hockey. With a minute 59 remaining in the overtime period, Becca Gilmore lifted the Crimson over Union when she roofed the puck from the slot. The win guaranteed Harvard home ice advantage for the ECAC Hockey Quarterfinals for the first time since 2015. At number 4, men's basketball. Noah Kirkwood, after probing the defense, reset the offense and attacked from the top of the three-point arc, only to step back and knock down the go-ahead three-pointer with a minute 10 left. Harvard prevailed at the end, defeating Columbia in double overtime, 77-73. At number three, women's water polo. With Harvard up 6-3 in the second quarter against 17th-ranked Wagner, sophomore Borden Wall received a pass and tipped the ball past the Seahawks goalie with her back to net. The goal put Harvard up 7-3 and would be the eventual game winner. The Crimson took a 9-6 victory. At number two, men's ice hockey. Trailing 4-3 with the extra attacker on the ice against rival Yale, sophomore Casey Dornbach found classmate Jack Rathbone for a one-timer that found the back of the net, helping the Crimson earn a tie in a game it trailed by three goals at one point. Rathbone had three points on the night, notching a goal and two assists. At number one, men's volleyball. With Harvard up 24-17 in the fourth set with a two-set to one lead, senior captain Matt Stivertlick set up sophomore Ryan Hong for the kill that earned the Crimson a 3-1 upset victory over 13th-ranked George Mason. The victory is Harvard's first overranked opponent since a 3-2 victory over then number 15 George Mason in the 2017 season. That's it for this week's top five plays. Check out the Ivy League on ESPN for more live and on-demand content.